Ugh. It's snowing. You know what that means? That means somebody's not leaving the house. <laughs> Good morning, NaNoWriMo. It's NaNoWriMo Day 25. So I had a pep talk planned for today, but that's getting delayed because my little terabyte drive will not connect to my Windows computers. And thankfully it's not bricked, but I can't transfer my videos from my phone onto the device, which then therefore can connect to my Mac because my phone won't connect to my Mac. Microsoft, Samsung, Apple, y'all suck. <laughs> my motivational video will have to be later when it finally uploads. Whatever gets it first, whether it's Google Drive or Dropbox, that's the one we'll pull it from. Yeah, here's a rant about Thanksgiving and snow. It's still snowing. <laughs> I don't, I don't do snow. Like, I do the cold. I do the cold. My window, my, my window's still open. We might have a problem. The frick? Okay, it's not as horrible as it could be. It's still snowing, but it's not sticking to the roads or the sidewalk, which means, now see, this is Harry Potter snow. Harry Potter cricket and be like, let's turn goblets into rats. But should we? Should we really? And Harry Potter curriculum be like, let's turn rats into goblets. But should we? Should we really be doing this? Especially if you're planning on drinking out of that goblet. I fear for your sanity. Now this is the kind of magic I'm talking about. Snow on the grass, or if you don't have grass like us, snow on the dirt, but no snow on the sidewalks and no snow on the streets. My kind of snow. <laughs> Except it's on the cars, which makes it not so magical. Well, I don't even want to leave the house now because it snowed. <laughs> Snow equals barricading myself in the house. I know people are like, you moved to Utah, you should have expected snow. Yeah, like New Jersey didn't get 10 feet of snow often. Like every other year. At least here we get Harry Potter magical snow. Yeah, I have a, like a love-hate relationship with Thanksgiving, especially this year. <sighs> For you people who do not live in the US, you do not know the joys and the horrors that is Thanksgiving. Unless you have your own Thanksgiving, then we commiserate just at different times of the year. <laughs> the amount of stress that is placed on the female members of the household is astronomical. Like, oh my word, I only have two people and two dogs in my household. We are going out to dinner, or we have been invited to places who have the same stress, or we've been invited to go out to dinner, and I'll bring a pie. Like, if I had my own family, Boston Market sounds really good. <laughs> Because I'm really not one to enjoy cooking. I am not, I just, I don't, I enjoy it to a certain extent and then I'm about done. I'm like, my maximum amount of cooking is about 10 minutes and then I'm like, okay, we're good. I ate salad. <laughs> salad takes three seconds to throw on a plate and we're good. We're good. That's all we need. But Thanksgiving requires like a 48 hours of preparation and I'm currently getting texts as we speak from a beautiful family member who is going out of their mind because they have a lot of people that they have to cook for. I'm so sorry. <laughs> like, can we not have the amount of stress placed upon our women during this time of festivities? I can just see that the world is going to burn including all of the snow because everybody got to do the Thanksgiving meal. <laughs> Can we stop murdering all the turkeys? I'm really just ranting and talking when I really don't have to, but you know, what else am I going to talk about? <laughs> Writing? I might not leave the house. I might be ordering Chinese food for Thanksgiving and happily eat it. If you enjoyed this video, then please give it a like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching. Bye.